so hello all in the previous video we have seen um how to send the temperature to a thing spot device right using the mqtt protocol now we have a dht11 sensor and we are going to send temperature as well as humidity so we are adding the humidity uh, value as well so for that you can see uh, previously we read the temperature using the inbuilt function Mm, and then um, now we are using another method read humidity of so which reads the humidity value so these are part of the uh, dst11 uh, libraries which you install and then uh, we are going to see if there is a failure of the data read here you can see we are actually sending two different parameters now humidity which is uh, adding a pledge and then each parameter separated by a comma and then as in the previous video we are sending the temperature now after that it's just client dot publish now you can see this this is already connected and we are getting the values continuously humidity is around 66 temperature is around 29.4 29.5 now if we go back okay uh, to the dashboard to the dashboard so this is the dashboard right so th this is the uh, table that uh, we have added to the dashboard now if we go to the enter edit mode okay we can add a widget so we already pre added temperature widget right now we will see a different widget like example let us go to the charts okay time series bar chart is something which displays um, data over time so that means it adds timestamp uh, to the um, to the data okay uh, so now let us click it and then add the entity you add a temperature sensor and then you have humidity and temperature which can be added and just click add and just apply changes okay now you can see there is a timestamp we are sending around 10 30 10 for every five seconds there is a data and the you might not be able to see below so we we'll just reduce it okay so okay so it's out of the scope of this video so below this chart we can see blue is the humidity value okay if if we scroll over the chart you can see humidity value is around 63 temperature is around 29.8 that's what we get right now for example let us add one more widget okay if we individually want uh, uh, the temperature okay we can add we'll add a radial gauge as we did previously and you can have the humidity value you can see the humidity value and then we'll apply okay once we apply and let's try to restart okay so there's a gap here because we restarted the system and we can see the data starting up okay so there is a problem with the humidity um, that is getting updated yeah you can see it got updated see uh, so this is how we can have the widgets um, for temperature and humidity in the same dashboard 